What's up, Pandus? Peter Von Panda here. Uh, just uh, received this. It's the Selfie Wink smartphone camera remote control. It's a Bluetooth uh, shutter release for your Android or iOS device. It comes packaged just like this. Um, it's uh, pretty similar. Uh, to some of the other ones I've shown you, but I wanted to get this one and try it out because as I unbox it here <clears throat> I want to tell you that it's once you get um, Once you are out and about and it comes with a little lanyard Out and about taking photos um, With when with your smartphone it really stinks not to have um you in those photos and so with especially with the iPhone there's no set uh, timer countdown and so you've got to basically either take the camera take a picture without you in it or ask someone to take a picture for you and that may not seem like the worst thing in the world but I can tell you when you ask someone to take a picture like I did this weekend uh, sometimes they suck at taking pictures so you know they crop your body out or your head out or they get they take a shot of the background with your forehead in it I mean it's it, it's pretty um, uh, it's kind of a crapshoot when you ask for help on that and the other thing that I can tell you is that uh, if, especially if you're using things like the rule of thirds or the golden mean or, or, or any of those types of things um, you can set up a, the camera on a tripod or prop it up with a rock and uh, get the, the picture the way you want it and then use one of these Bluetooth remotes to actually activate the shutter. So first things first, it comes with a lithium battery and I believe on the package it says that this sucker can last up to three years without having to change the battery, which I, I, I would actually suspect is probably... Uh, pretty accurate. Um, I just opened up the the package and I noticed that oh There goes my camera. Sorry about that. I must be in a grizzly's butt because that is in bare ass ing so um, And it has a battery inside it uh, Which is actually pretty cool because it sure looks like it comes with two batteries So I'm just gonna leave that original one in there for now. I'm gonna go ahead and Lock this back up. You use just a coin to um, put the battery in and out. And it has this uh, the Bluetooth button for pairing. I assume it'll ask you uh, which you can toggle between the Android and iOS OSs here. And then this, is, I assume, is a shutter release. Now I just want to take a quick peek at the instructions um, because I'm not exactly sure how you would uh, determine which OS. So it says. When you hit the OS button, the blue light indicates Android and red indicates iOS. So, first of all, we're going to give this sucker a shot. It's got a power button on the side. Um, down is on and up, as it is right here, is off. So, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to power on this iPhone. And go to the Bluetooth in the settings. I'm going to turn this on. And since it's never been paired with anything... I think it might actually immediately go into pairing mode. So, looks like it's right there, the selfie wink. I'm going to go ahead and tap it. Boom, connected. Um, so, first things first, it looks like, if, if I, you can see the OS there, it's in blue, and that means Android. So, if I hit it, boom, goes over to red. Pretty simple. So, that should be iOS. Now, I'm going to go into the camera app find it here camera and now we're into the camera app and I'm gonna just hit this boom 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 awesome works uh, perfectly right out of the box uh, Bluetooth it typically has a range of about 30 feet 10 meters and uh, my my tests with these have been that uh, it does ex pretty much exactly that the the thing that I would uh, mention is that if you're really burying in your hand or there's a lot of obstructions in the line of sight it may or may not uh, get quite that range but as you can see no problems one of the other questions that uh, someone else has asked me is does it work with the video recording function on uh, the device and absolutely since it's just a, a shutter release to start and it starts right there well this is totally meta I'm totally recording a video of a phone recording a video 
um, and then you just hit the shutter release again to stop it. So you can absolutely use this as a, a, a remote um, activation for the video camera or for the, the camera itself. Pretty awesome, uh, really unique um, ideas because uh, everyone is realizing that taking um, photos remotely is is more and more of a problem. One of the other things I would throw out here is because it's called selfie wink that um, it's also very helpful to take selfies. So if you've if you're ever trying to take a photo using the front facing camera you know that on most cameras they are a much lower uh, quality camera or um, uh, sensor on the the front than they are on the back. The, the issue though is you can line up uh, the picture better because you've got a picture of the screen um, but you usually should probably use the back camera because it's such a, a higher resolution camera. The problem there is you don't know where that uh, shutter button is on the screen back here so you'd have to kind of, I'm trying to do it here, I can kind of, I'm tapping it like four or five times. All right, and I found it there again. Or you can use the volume up button on iOS devices. All right, there it went. The problem is with that is you've got to really kind of grab it because you've got to put some uh, some muscle down on it to, to get that button and sometimes it shakes a little bit, but not with the selfie wink. Boom, 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 yeah baby. Totally took a bunch of selfies of myself there. That is, uh, that is some high quality photos, I guarantee. But uh, selfie wink, great for uh, being out and about uh, and want to take pictures of you and your group or just the uh, selfie without uh, your hand in the way. Set it up on a tripod, prop it up with a rock or against the wall, whatever, and uh, snap some photos. So Peter Von Panda for the selfie wink, Bluetooth, remote shutter control for Android and iOS. Uh, check it out. It's uh, pretty cheap, uh, 20 or 30 bucks. Totally worthwhile having around. This is actually not a very big device. It's only about the size of a, a, a matchbook or something like that. And it comes with this lanyard as we spoke about. So you can always have it on your key ring, which is what I do. So you have it whenever you need it. Um, that's Panda. Out!